Good morning, Bridgehampton School. Mr. Barker here back for WBEE Virtual Radio Friday edition. We made it through another week. Woo-hoo! That's what I say. On today's announcements, do we finally find out what the weather was this week? And more classes are jumping in on the Gratitude Game Challenge. We also have a worrying shredder. Stay tuned. Today is Friday, January 15th. It is a B-Day. Please stand for the pledge. Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, the indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. That was Azavion Clark from first grade with our pledge today. Great job, Azavion. All right, we have not known what the weather is all week. Is someone out there? Uh, that is a very scruffy weather bear excited for the weekend. He is saying it might rain, but warmer in the 40s. And I'm sorry, I really need to get him a haircut. So hey, here are our announcements for the day. We want to remind everyone that we have a three-day weekend this week in honor of Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Monday celebrates the civil rights leader's life and legacy. And I'm excited to announce that we have more classes participating in the Gratitude Game Challenge. Kindergarten is thankful for so many things. I'm thankful for my friends. I'm thankful for my teachers. I'm thankful for my friends. I'm thankful for my family and friends. I'm thankful for my sister. I'm thankful for my brother, my family, and my friends. I'm thankful for my family. Awesome job. Kindergarten cohort one is jumping in on the fun. Which class will be next to take the challenge? Second grade cohort one, come on, tell us what you're thankful for. Speaking of kindergarten, kindergarten cohort two has been learning about worries and the best way to make them go away. Sharing your worries is the best way to make sure that they don't get bigger. Students drew about their worries and then took them to the worrying shredder. the challenge all you gotta do is leave it better than you found it it's gonna get difficult to stand but hold your balance i just say what Awesome job. That is such a fun way to learn about leaving your worries behind. And here is our daily inspirational quote from sixth grader Lily Day Fiakovsky. The harder you work for something, the greater you feel when you achieve it. What a great quote. The harder you work for something, the greater you feel when you achieve it. Achieving your goals is the best feeling. Man, I remember how great it felt to win a gold medal for chicken catching in the 1940 Winter Olympics. Such a great time. And I'm sorry that I have been announcing your last name wrong this whole time time lily my apologies and just a reminder to stay up to date on the black and gold hybrid schedule black is in person tuesday and wednesday of next week and gold thursday and friday and we are continuing with our week of smart goals we've learned all week how to make our goals smart the t in smart stands for time bound every goal needs a target date you can say you want to make honor roll by quarter three or you want to read your new book by march 1st so now that we know about smart goals send me your smart goal bridgehampton or what you are up to we'd love to have you on the announcements all right that is it for our announcements today we're going to turn up that birthday music because we have a few weekend birthdays we want to say happy birthday to miles clark whose birthday is on saturday and the art guru miss g's actual birthday is saturday as well you get two birthday shout outs this year miss g hey from wbee virtual radio this is mr barker signing off until tuesday enjoy your three-day weekend bridgehampton family see you next week as always please remember to learn well in the same day so make sure you wash your hands and wash out and merry christmas guys i love you guys hey feeling good like i should Winning dog to walk around the neighborhood Feeling blessed